Oh, Grisham, you do weave a tale. Well, hello. I didn't see you there. Welcome to my reading nook. Would you like to hear a story? You would. Well, come a little closer. Not that, not that close. Little, little space. Thank you. Today we'll be reading Morse Sendex classic, In the Night Kitchen. Are you ready? Let's begin. Did you ever hear of Mickey, how he heard a racket in the night, and he shouted, quiet down there. And he fell through out of the dark, out of his clothes, for some reason. And past the moon and his mama and papa sleeping tight, and so now he's, he's naked. And into the light of the night kitchen. There, we'll just cover that up. And then in walk three sort of fat Hitlers. That's kind of, there's even a, a Jewish star there. This is getting kind of weird. Uh, and they walk in and, and they're gonna probably help him get out of that. No, they start, they start cooking. They start, uh, what are they? The milk in the batter, milk in the batter, stir it, scrape it, make it, bake it. This, okay. And then, oh, Mickey jumps out. So good. Mickey jumps out. I'm not milk. I'm not, the milk is not me. I'm Mickey. That's, that was a close call. And then Mickey does what any young child would do. He jumps into the, the bread and he starts in the dough making a, a plane. For, he make, he's making a plane out of, out of the dough and then he, he's got the plane going, so that's good. He, now he's flying away. Now the, the sort of fat Hitler guys uh, are, are kind of freaking out. They think he's milk. They're yelling, milk, milk, milk for the morning cake. So he really should just get the hell out of there, really is what he should do. But now he's like, no, I'm, I'm working for you guys now. Um, and, and so he says, Oh, what, what's all the fuss? I'm Mickey the pilot. I get milk the Mickey way. So I guess we're gonna find out now how Mickey uh, is going to get milk. Um, so he goes flying and he flies up higher, higher, over the top of the Milky Way of the night kitchen. So now he's over a big vat of milk. So we'll see what he does. Maybe lower down a bucket or something. No, he dives him. He dives straight in singing, I'm in the milk and the milk's in me. I don't know what that means. And of course he has to get naked again in the in the milk um so there we go god bless milk and god bless me because <laughs> he's a christian uh and then see he's swimming in the milk and then in this milk that this toddler is swimming butt naked he gets some of that milk and pours it down into the hitler bowl down below and the bakers they mix it and beat it and baked it and then they make some cake and they're singing milk in the batter milk in the batter we bake the cake and nothing's the matter, in, unless you're a health inspector. Uh, and then I'm pretty sure there's a case of hepatitis somewhere happening in the vicinity. Of, it might be the sequel to this book, but it will happen. Oh, oh, this is a nice surprise. And then we get this shot of Mickey yelling out, Cock-a-doodle-doo! I, I, the image and the phrase together. Anyway, uh, then he slides back down the milk into his bed. Uh, carefree and dried. Then we end off the story with, and that's why, thanks to Mickey, we have cake every morning. Well, the most important thing about uh, In the Night Kitchen is it's a story that teaches us a special lesson. Thanks for visiting the Reading Nook.